Uh, debating the question, uh, be it resolved, television makes people smarter. We have Rachel Manson and Sam Norton. Oh, Rachel, mm. arguing for the proposition, you have one minute, starting now. Magic school bus. Done. End. Finished. Everything you know, scientifically speaking, is from Magic School Bus. <laughs> you do not know a single fucking thing if it were not for Magic School Bus. I know basic math from Magic School Bus. <laughs> I know things about my own organs. How fucking crazy is that? That in school, we are not taught ex extensively and enough about our working bodies that they had to turn on a VHS tape of someone <laughs> with a lizard shrinking down and going into our bloodstream. If you don't have Magic School Bus, you have no idea what's going on in there. It's just a mishmash of chaos. And I'm a woman, so it still is medically speaking. But regardless, Magic School Bus is your number one. I know the ingredients for meth. That's not from <laughs> that's from Breaking Bad, but I know that, and I know um, I'm just, this is just gonna become things lists of things I know. Um, I know how a bill becomes a law. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Excellent call out. All I right. don't. All right, I don't. All right. All right. Oh. oh well. You're out of time. Okay. <laughs> Arguing against the proposition, we have Sam Norton. So uh, you have one minute starting now. All right, everything she said was bullshit. <laughs> uh, yeah, you just you kind of proved my point, saying I learned everything from Magic School Bus. I like I'm an idiot, and I also think I know stuff, but that's because <laughs> you just equated science with magic. That's the problem. We're all fucking idiots going like, ah, your blood works because the fuck the lizard was. Yeah, we well, none of us know anything. I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a dyslexic dick joke artist. And, <laughs> And I have opinions about the, the event horizon simply because some black dude in a vest did an ASMR documentary. That's not, <laughs> that's not knowledge. That's all of us going like, I'm smart. And then the world collapses and we die in two weeks. That's why everything has happened. Uh, other than that, yeah, TV's great. <laughs> all right. Thank you, Sam. <laughs> Rachel, you have 30 seconds to respond. Oh, my God. Starting... <laughs> Starting now. Now, I'm not a good living example of being smart from television, <laughs> nor am I a good living example of being smart from anything, because I don't retain information. I smoke a lot of pot, and the thing about that is it doesn't give you much memory retention. I don't remember basic human events, basic memories, or things I watch on television, but one thing I do know is I was hoping if I just kept talking, I would think... <laughs> <laughs> Something would come to me that I learned from television. And you know what it is this? That it that some people are bisexual. Thank you, Tila Tequila, who is enough. All right, Sam, you have the last word. 30 seconds starting now. So now I'm anti-bisexual? I don't know how this... Yeah, that's a great debate tactic. <laughs> hey, I'm losing. Now this guy's homophobic. Uh, well, fine, if we're going to talk about what we learned from TV, uh, I uh, come from America, so uh, I guess I'm pro-Trump, I'm very racist and homophobic, so uh, yeah, TV makes you smart. You see what, I did, that did, hold on, no, give me 20 more seconds. Uh, do you know the first, this is just a fact, do you know, hold on, give me a second. Do you know the first thing that was publicly broadcast over the entire planet uh, was a Hitler speech? What? Yeah. No, that was just an episode of Heil Hitler. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's it. Thank you very much. Okay, now you, the audience, get to decide. Do you <laughs> do you agree with do you do you agree with Rachel Manson that television makes people smarter, or do you agree with Sam Norton that television makes people dumber, or whatever he said? All right, Rachel wins. That's one point for the Golden Girls. Wow.